Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 3rd, around March 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, whatever. The timing is fluid. We're just going to see what comes up. Um, remember, the timing is fluid, so this reading, I'm doing it today, but typically, you know, sometimes they resonate that very day, the next day, or a week later, so keep that in mind. You might see a little bruise on my hand. They tried to put an IV in there and did not succeed. But anyhow, um, so let's see. What do we got? What do we have for the upcoming message? We have a relationship that's no longer on the same page, and I hate to say that, but that's what I just see. You know, uh, we have two people that are just are not on the same page. Somebody may be receiving some poor counsel because what I see is the hair of font reversed. So that's poor counsel, receiving advice from somebody who who's not very spiritual or somebody that is clueless, somebody that just doesn't know, you know, listening to advice from the wrong person, you know, and it is affecting their relationship status. So something could be happening like that. Somebody is being controlled. Um, they may be being controlled by some sort of social pressure. Somebody is having a hard time doing the right thing. Six of Pentacles reversed. This is a rejection of some sort. Um, firing. Okay, somebody could be getting fired. There's there's strong control. And this is not following advice. Interesting how shit comes out. Okay, it's like there's been some sort of injustice. Somebody is trying to abuse their power. Um, there's a lack of give and take. There's a lack of reciprocation. They're, it's like taking away something. Somebody's not putting in effort. Uh, let's see. We need to get some... What is this? Ooh, we have somebody here that's greedy. Yes, greedy. Somebody here that is very stubborn and greedy. Both these cards. So we got somebody here that wants to hold on to something. They don't want to give. They want to hold on. They don't want it to go. They don't want to give it away. So somebody is being selfish and greedy. That's what we got so far. Hmm. Not giving anything. Not giving this away. Ooh, Page of Cups and the Two of Pentacles. Now we have a juggler here. Somebody that's going back and forth. The, the, the Page of Cups is about a welcome message of love, an opportunity for love. Uh, you know, there's a new opportunity for love here. But we have somebody here that's having a hard time making a choice. So somebody may, somebody may be juggling, going back and forth. It's like they have this opportunity for love, but they, they got to do something. They got to make some sort of choice. You can't have both. You can't have your cake and eat it too. So it looks like somebody has an opportunity for love, but they're having a hard time making a decision. She's like, I want to have both. I can, I can do both. I can do both. Meanwhile, there's a ship that is sailing away. So I think that there's a, sh this person is like, ah, it doesn't even realize, doesn't even realize that their ship is sailing away. So yeah, we have somebody that doesn't realize that they are losing something. They are because this is a rejection. Interesting. Um, somebody doesn't realize that the ship is sailing. This page of cups is somebody that is looking for love. This is a dreamer. We could also have somebody here. This is naive and this is naive. So we have somebody here that is very naive. They may not see that somebody is holding on to them. Hmm. Somebody is acting naively. Interesting. Somebody here that is struggling, trying to find balance, trying to do both things. So this is act now. Think later. This is somebody that needs to take action right now. They need to take action immediately. Because there could be somebody else that is, is riding on in. So this is somebody, this is, this is something uh, happening very fast. Something being exposed, exposed, uh, opening up. It's open your eyes. 
Somebody needs to open their eyes and open their heart. Somebody's been blocking their heart, blocking their feelings, not opening their heart, and they need to take action. So we have somebody here that needs to take action, and they're going to take action. Somebody's going to take action because this is somebody who, you know, kicks it into high gear. But this two of swords reversed, this is fear. There's been a delay. And this is now somebody that is seeing the truth of a situation. <laughs> we have somebody here that is... But over here, this is... Uh, we have somebody that is not... Hasn't been opening up. This person is selfish, greedy, not giving. Not giving, not reciprocating, not doing something. Very... Very selfish and greedy. Now, they need some sort of attitude adjustment with the world reversed. We have somebody here that's not learning a lesson. Doesn't learn from mistakes. Needing to take a step immediately. So we have somebody here that needs to open their eyes before there's, I mean, this, this, they lose a relationship. The three of cups reversed is parting ways. This party is over. There's some sort of competitiveness. There could be some bitchy women here. Women that pretend that they're your friend, but they have ulterior motives. These, these, this could be gossip. Some gossips that are trying to uh, block a relationship or something like that. This could be a couple of women, three women, two women, something like that that are that are affecting a relationship. Now this is blocking, and this is parting ways. It's like, uh-uh, no. Somebody's about to take action. Going back and forth, struggling. There's going to be some sort of loss. This is separation. There's going to be, somebody's going to lose something. This is separation and loss, the Five of Cups. Deep sor sorrow. Regret. Somebody's going to be regretting. There's a third party situation here. The Three of Cups is a third party situation. It's like three's a crowd. Three is a crowd. So because there's a third party situation, there's this is a loss. This is a loss. So somebody is losing an opportunity for love. Somebody is losing an opportunity for love. Because somebody is seeing the truth. Maybe they weren't seeing it, but now the truth, this is being exposed. So this is exposure. The two, Something is being exposed about a third party situation, which is causing a big loss. It's like there's nothing to think about. Okay, with the Knight of Wands, it's like action. This is action. Something happens fast. King of Pentacles. King of Swords. Woo! Oh, the Emperor reversed. Son of a gun. This is, this is crazy shit right here. So, holy moly. Somebody's going to get angry. This person right here is going to get angry. Get angry and frustrated and upset. And it's because there's a lack of, of uh, learning from the past mistakes. You can't hold on to something. you get, you got to let go. you got to let go. So we have somebody here that is holding on to something that they need to let go of. It's like they want to have their cake and eat it too. This guy is going to get angry. Now the emperor in reverse is somebody that... Um, doesn't, well, this person can be naive, is not experienced, may be controlling, may be power hungry, may be, um, corrupt. This person is only out for their own good, doesn't, doesn't care, no feelings. We have somebody here that is lacking, uh, feeling. Okay, they're lacking feeling. They're not, they're not, they're probably not thinking very clearly either. But you notice we have three here, so I'm not sure if we're dealing with, with three masculines or just one or two or whatnot. 
But we have a king of pentacles here that is has something solid in his hand, okay? He is stable. He is solid. He is... Looks like he's a big, huge opportunity right there, okay? And it's sudden. This is very sudden. So it looks like there's a sudden entrance. There is a sudden entrance here, perhaps from this person, which is a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Could be a uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be an Aries, but could be anybody. Could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Whoever this person is, this person is uh, hardworking. This person has a lot to offer. Looks like he he is holding holding on to something, holding on to something valuable. He has something valuable to offer. He has something valuable to offer, something big. Mm -hmm. This guy is cold. This guy is cold, and he is mean. So I think this is the same person. Now, I don't know. I don't know. This person is cold-hearted. This person doesn't communicate well. May use silent treatment. Gets angry and gets upset. Now, this world card, there's unfinished business with the past. Somebody keeps flogging a dead horse. You know? It's time to step over that finish line. The past is dead. So it's like we have somebody here that, that just cannot find their strength or whatever. The their ability to cut something out or something like that. Now this is holding on to something. Hmm. Somebody's definitely going to get angry. They're going to there's going to somebody is going to get very very angry. And they may get angry because there's going to be a loss. There's a third party situation here. There is. We have the three of cups here and the three of cups here. Somebody is losing out on an opportunity for love because of another woman or another man or whatever the case is. It's, it's, it's like you got You can't have both. So we have somebody here that is probably going to be experiencing some sort of heartache or experiencing some regrets and they may get really angry. They get, may get really angry and upset because of this loss. So, hmm. It's like there's, there's something that doesn't end successfully. It doesn't end successfully. Because this person it isn't seeing a situation clearly. He's naive or something. But this guy, this guy... He's come in suddenly by the looks of things. Although this could all be the same guy. This is a sudden entrance, okay? From somebody with something in their hand, a gift of some sort. Ooh, lack of hope. Lack of, of hope, lack of inspiration. We do have somebody here that is, is probably going to have some regrets. There's fear. There's some sort of fear here. Why? Why? That's what it is. It's like, why? There's sadness. There's some sort of sadness here. Somebody is going to be experiencing some sadness because they didn't take action and when they should have or something, they didn't reciprocate. They were holding on to something that they needed to let go of. Okay? So it's like somebody is probably going to be saying, why, why, is why, 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 why? It's, and it's almost like getting mad and placing blame and saying, this is all your fault. This is all your fault. Why, why did you do this? Why did you do this? You know, that's what I hear. Why did you do this? Why did you do this? Why couldn't you keep your mouth shut? Because this is the, this is the bitchy women or somebody imposing the third party situation. Somebody that butted their nose in. Moving on, Chariot. Now this is a card of, of forward movement. 
taking a journey, moving away. Ten of Pentacles reversed. There's been some sort of fam turning away from a feud, turning away from a family feud, giving up, because there's some sort of giving up with the star, giving up on this situation, something to do with the family, moving, moving in a new direction, leaving it all behind. Something about the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, um, making a decision, making a decision to, you know, take action by the looks of things. This guy takes action, mastering emotions, getting it in the driver's seat, going someplace. Somebody's going to be going someplace. And it could be, it could have to do with leaving leaving the the somebody in the family behind or turning a, a turning away from family that you know because the three of cups reverse and this ten of wands or ten of pentacles reverse could be a family issue where these families just don't support you anymore you know there's a lack of family support so i think we have somebody here that is deciding Finding the discipline to take action. Very determined. We have somebody here that is very determined. Ooh, that one we're going to have to take. Determined to hold on to something. This guy wants to hold on to something. So we do have somebody here that is, is determined to hold on. Doesn't want to let go carrying something two of wands reversed a stop we have somebody here that is stopped They've been delaying making a decision. They have. There's been a lack of, there's been, been an inability, an inability to make a decision. And they've been very overwhelmed. We have somebody here that has been very overwhelmed. But it looks like they're going to find their mental strength. They are going to find some sort of mental strength. Because something is going to happen that is going to make them ask what they want. They're going to ask themselves, you know, why, 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 why? That's what I keep saying. Why, why, why? This is not what I wanted. This is not what I wanted. And they're going to be forced basically to make a choice. That is make a choice, make a decision. I think there's some sort of rejection or somebody that is, you know, giving up. They're giving up. They don't, they're not going to put in any more effort. They're not going to give any more. And now there's a, there's sadness. There's some sort of sadness. Somebody wasn't seeing a situation clearly. It's like they want to hold on. They do. I feel like we have somebody here that wants to hold on. They want to hold on to what they had, but there's been a meddler. We have a meddler here, and this meddler has caused problems. So I think that there's going to be some sort of angry situation. Anger. Maybe a bout of anger. Ooh. Eight of Wands reversed. Whew. This is uh, feeling guilty. Somebody could be blocking, getting blocked, you know, or blocking somebody. Somebody could get really, really mad, I think. And there could be some jealousy issues here. I feel like somebody's going to get really, 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 really mad. And they may say some really mean things. It could happen very suddenly. So it could, it could just all of a sudden somebody bursts, okay, with that Knight of Wands under there. They burst. There's a relationship that doesn't, isn't ending on a successful note. Ten of Cups reversed. There's relationship problems. That's, the, that's what I started this reading out. Remember before, before I saw the very first words, I said there's a relationship that is no longer on the same page. That is our last card right there. There is a relationship that is no longer on the same page. And I think things are about to change. 
because somebody's going to get very, 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 very upset. It's like all of a sudden too. And I think it's because something gets revealed because this is, this is, uh, lies or truths getting revealed. Somebody seeing something, you know, they weren't seeing it. Now they're seeing it. Same, same. So there's some sort of reality checks. There's somebody is, something is going, a truth is going to be revealed or something, an epiphany. Okay. Or an awakening or whatever it is. Something, something that somebody has been hiding the truth or they've been, sneaky or they this is a pisces card by the way pisces or cancer or whatever but um anyway somebody has been pretending something and i think that uh the truth is going to come out it's like somebody is going to see past that shadow it's like the light is going to be shown on a situation and they're going to they're we you know <laughs> shit is about to hit the fan put it that way I feel like um, something is about to be shown that was hidden. It's going to be seen very clearly. And I think it's going to cause some waves. Okay. I think it's going to cause some waves. I think there's going to probably be some sort of fight or argument. And there could be a loss of a relationship here. Um, somebody could get in their vehicle and actually leave and go someplace. It's like I'm out of here with that chariot card. Okay. Um Maybe they're going to go and try to build something back up to fix something. They may try to go fix something. Um, this is definitely a why, 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 why is this happening? Something is about to happen, which is going to cause one person to say, you know, why? Why is this happening? You know, this was this was love, right? The night of the page of cups. This was an opportunity for love. But it looks like it, it didn't, or it's not ending successfully because I think there's a third party situation here. So I think this third party situation uh, causes a loss. Good luck.